Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. I'm so glad you're here. Today I'll be showing you how to easily add a free product coupon in WooCommerce. Free product coupons are not only beneficial for you, but also for your customers as it elevates their shopping experience. So let's dive in and learn how to create one. And in this video, I'm going to make use of an excellent plugin called Discount Rules Pro to set this up. All right. Trust me, it's a breeze to set up with this plugin. So I have already installed the plugin, both Core and Pro on my site. And it's very easy to install. You can find the installation video for further steps for you to know in the description below. Feel free to check it out. With that installed, let's go and set up this free product coupon in WooCommerce using this plugin. Once you install the plugin, you'll be able to go to WooCommerce. Under WooCommerce, you'll find discount rules, which will take you to the discount rules dashboard once you click on it and then you'll be led to this page where you can start creating your own new discount rule so to do that let's click on this add new rule button which will take us to the configuration page and here you have the opportunity to configure your own rules for your store so let's begin by entering a rule title so i'm going to be offering a beanie with logo for free if customers buy any product from my store you can also be very specific about what products customers need to buy. So I'm going to be entering a rule title to be free beanie with logo. All right. This is also useful for you to clear your stock if it's not moving very well. So that's a strategy right there. After you enter the rule title, you can choose your discount type by clicking on this drop down menu and you will be presented with a lot of options. The option that I'm going to select for this particular scenario is going to be a buy X, get Y rule type. And next comes the filter. <clears throat> well, next comes the filter. And here you have the opportunity to decide which are the products in your store are eligible for this particular coupon. All right. Or discount. So let's just go ahead and decide what we want. Since I mentioned I'm going to be giving this for all products that is customers can buy any product from my cart and then get this free beanie with logo all right so if you're specific about certain products or categories you can very well choose from these filters here with that configured let's move on to the next thing which is the discount type so here you have the opportunity to select what kind of discount you want to offer for your store so let me just go to this select types and use YX get Y products because I have a specific product that I want to give to customers for free. After you select this one, you'll be able to see that the YX count based on is set to filters set above. This is a default thing. This will definitely take the filters that you've set here into consideration. That's what it means for the YX count. And then you have mode of apply, which we will talk about a little later. Now let's go on and set the buy quantity and the get quantity etc so buy quantity this minimum quantity is the least quantity that customers need to buy of any of the products that you have set in the filters in order for them to qualify for this particular discount so we will just set one here maximum quantity is the maximum quantity that customer can buy in order for the discount to work so i'm going to leave this empty you can choose to leave it empty if you don't want customers to be restricted with a certain quantity or you can also choose to give something like triple nine or something like that. All right. I'm going to leave this empty now. And then we have the get quantity box. And here we're going to select the product that we're going to present to customers as a gift or a free product. All right. So let me select that product that I have in my mind, which is Beanie with logo. After you select the free product here, you're also going to decide the free quantity of the product that you're going to offer to your customers. You can choose according to your requirements, but for now, I'm just going to go with one free product for customers purchase. And then comes the discount type. You can either go for free percentage discount or fixed discount. But since this is appropriate for this particular scenario that we're dealing with, I'm going to be selecting free here. Let's go back to the mode of apply. You can decide if you want this particular free product to be automatically added to customer's cart, or you can also let your customers manually add it to their card but for this particular thing i'm going to be selecting auto add because i want my customers to get the free product automatically apply to their cart all right now next comes the interesting case where we're going to 
make use of a coupon in order for this discount to be activated. You can go without a coupon as well, but let me show you what happens when we add a coupon condition here. Let's click on this add condition and choose from the drop down coupon set option. And here you will be able to create your own new coupon for this free product. All right, so let's just name it. Oh, give a name for your coupon and then your coupon is ready. That is it. Now, only upon customers entering this coupon at the card or checkout, they will be given this product for free. So let me just save this rule now and show you how it works. To see how it works, I'm going to take you to the shop page, add few products to the cart and show you what happens. So let us just purchase this beanie. Well, go to the cart page and here you will be able to notice that we do not have any free product added yet. That's because we have not made use of the coupon. So customers need to enter the coupon here. I've named the coupon big deal. And then once you apply the coupon, you'll be able to see that the free product is auto added to the card with the label free. And you can also see that the coupon is applied here in the card. That is it. We've successfully learned how to add a free product coupon in WooCommerce using the amazing discount rules plugin. It's definitely a game changer and definitely worth trying out. So I will suggest you to buy the plugin today and start enjoying the perks that it offers. I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye.